So, you want a mobile solution, and you want it fast. You want it to just appear and be ready to use. And this should be really easy. So instead of starting from scratch, try ready-made iPad layout designs built specifically for FileMaker Go. You choose from a library of ready-made designs. Each design meticulously crafted for the iPad. With complementary form and list views, all ready for that simple little double click to assign your fields so you can be productive as quickly as possible. Before you know it, you're up and running and being productive in no time with a mobile solution at a fraction of the cost. All of this is possible with the Scriptology Theme Studio. This is a FileMaker productivity toolkit. So let's take a look inside. So here we are in the Theme Studio. It's just a regular FileMaker file. It has five main areas. We can see those right here where we're starting out in icons. Then we have layouts. We have objects, colors, and then also gradients. Now, each of these five areas simply represents a suite of tools that you can use to really enhance your own FileMaker designs. Of course, as I mentioned in the intro, if you just want to get started, all you have to do is drag and drop, double click, and you're ready to go. Taking a look at the layout section, we can see one of the layouts that I've picked out. It's this layout right here called Binary Foundation. Now I can see there are four items and I can see that I have a list view of the desktop right now. Now given that you're looking for iPad solutions potentially, I simply click the image to cycle through all of the different options. I've landed on the portrait view or the form view of the iPad version of this particular theme. I'm going to drag my database on screen. I've already gone up to the view layout mode, so I'm in layout mode on my file ready to copy. All I do is select, drag from this container and drop. And the layout is now ready to be used. In my own database of course I have my own fields so I simply double click and then click the field that I want to assign and I'm ready to go. This is how easy it is to get started with your own themes on the iPad because of the Theme Studio. Now, of course, the Theme Studio has a ton more items that you can use beyond layouts. Those are included in the objects where you have arrows, you have gradients, you have calendars, and all kinds of different little widgets, portals, etc. Colors and managing color palettes for all of your different themes or your projects. And gradients, which really give your theme a pop. It gives it that real world look and feel. And of course, we can't forget icons. Icons are so easy you just simply select on the icon you want, drag it over to your file, and there it is. With the icon builder we can simply combine combinations of icons and pretty much create whatever we want. Being able to adjust the icons by shifting them in pixel increments, making offsets, being able to set these to darker or lighter colors, making them translucent, or transparent so you can see through them making them darker also being able to make grayscale versions in order to make that dimmed out non-active look and feel so if you want more information about this product the theme studio head over to filemakerthemes.com and simply download a copy it's completely free you get free icons there's a couple of layouts that are available and you're ready to go. If you decide to purchase, then of course you'll have access to all of the different layouts depending on your subscription that you make, whether you choose to get the subscription to annual themes or just buy a one-time purchase of a large bulk of themes. It's completely up to you. Using this product, you're going to be able to enhance your FileMaker database and instantly be ready to go with your iPad mobile solutions and do it really, really fast. So I'm wishing you much luck with your FileMaker development. And until next time, happy FileMaking.